Honey. Yes? You're off today. I am. You know what we should do? No, what? I'll give you a hint. It's within this frame. Work on the bathroom. Work on the bathroom a little bit. Okay. Uh, I mean, and do a bunch of other stuff too. Right. But at least work on the bathroom a little bit. Sure. You should come join us. Won't you? Mm-hmm. So first things first, we are at Menards because we need to look for some lights for the bathroom yes. and a mirror for the bathroom downstairs. Uh, also, Trumbull County is one of the counties in Ohio where you have to wear a face mask no matter where you're at. And Menards is one of the stores that you have to wear a face mask no matter what. So we're face masking it off. We are. A little warm in it today. There's lights everywhere. Uh, the ones we're looking at are on this first row, mainly. Uh, I remember the first time I came in here seeing this, I was like, holy crap, it is super bright. And it still is. But I've learned to adjust to it. I think we found them already. Uh, I think that went pretty quick. Yeah, that went super quick. Uh, we were looking at this wall over here, which was like the all-in, like everything right, all together. Right, all-in-one. And then I found this wall, where it's a mix and match. And I'm kind of, I really like these, like the little oval, like bubbles. Yeah, I don't in know if those. you can see them on the camera of that well. I thought they were really cool. Mm -hmm. So, and, and you know what? This is cheaper. Yeah, this route is cheaper. This is brushed. No, what is this? This is brushed, brushed steel. steel. Everything else in the bathroom is brushed nickel. Okay. Should be close enough. It's not going to be like shiny versus dull. Right. They're both right, going to be right. dull. So I, like I, think I think we're in good shape. Work out. And that went super quick. Good. Now we got time to look around. Okay. Okay. So while we're here, we decided we pick up some of these bigger uh, caps for our wall. See if these match. Because if they did, I think this would be a lot easier than those little one inch ones. And a lot cheaper. So we're going to try those out when we get home. Okay, back home and back in the bathroom. If you remember where we left off a couple weeks ago, uh, I was getting ready to replace this with a proper one at the proper height for the shower head. Now that's where I'm going to pick it up today get that replaced, and then I should be able to uh, put the board on this wall here. Uh, the other thing I gotta do first is run this wire uh, through the stud to this section over here. Then we should be able to put the green board on. That's hopefully how much I get done today, we'll see. Uh, the green board's gonna be kind of be a pain in the butt because of all the cutting around down here. But we should be able to get it figured out pretty easy. And just like that, the uh, shower head water line is all glued up. Yeah, there was no behind the scenes stuff of gluing and prepping, any of that at all. Cutting, right? any of that. No, it just magically it just appeared. Magically appears. <laughs> uh, the only thing I wish it did was magically like attach itself to the wall. <laughs> yeah, would that be nice? Which we have to do next. Uh, so while that's drying, we're going to attach that to the wall. We're going to run this cord. And then after that's done, it still has to dry longer. So I think we'll go outside and without the kitty, see how those bricks we bought look on the retaining wall. Yeah. So yeah, do you ever have one of those moments when you're drilling a hole through a stud, actually two studs, trying to fish a wire through it, and it's not working, you can't figure it out, and your honey goes, babe, isn't there a big hole right up there that you can just slide it right through? <laughs> it was fun watching you struggle, though. It almost like lost a hand doing that. <laughs> it's through, yay! <laughs> Holy crap, was that easy that way. Okay, uh, that's attached. Now while that's drying, let's go outside and look at this uh, hair retaining wall. Okay. Okay, that's how it's kind of going to look. Uh-huh. Uh, which I like the look. I like the look. However. The colors do not match. Correct. Uh, it might be too whitewashed or sun washed to see the difference. But yeah, the colors do not match. Uh, we need something with more grays and browns instead of more grays and blacks. Which I don't know if they have much gray and brown. Might have to just go with something more brown in general. I think it would still tie in and look a lot better. What that. we need to do is take a couple of these small ones and uh, compare the colors. Yeah, maybe. Uh, maybe but that's a good idea. Here's why we're thinking about using these to begin with. Okay, I kind of put these on top of each other so you could see. There are nine of the little ones lined up to three of the big ones. Right. Now the little ones cost a dollar and some change each. The big ones cost two dollars and some change each right so in the course of about what is that about 20 inches sure. uh we we're able to save a little over 33 percent about 35 mm percent -hmm. so 
and it's going to be a lot easier to put. It's going to be a lot easier. Yeah, it's going to be a lot easier to put the big ones down than the small ones. Right. Uh, so I think we do want to go with the bigger ones. We just got to get the color right. Right. It means we got to go back to Menards. Yay. I don't know when we're going to do that, but. I don't either. It needs to be sooner than later. But yeah, uh, I do like how I think it's going to look when it's all finished. Me too. Okay, so while Kristen's upstairs doing some banking stuff, I'm going to start laying out the drywall for this here piece. Uh, should be pretty straightforward, a rectangle. Uh, the bottom's going to be a little bit complicated with this jet out here. Uh, I got to make a hole for that and I got to make a hole for that. So I'm just going to lay it out on a piece of paper. That way, when we go to actually cut the drywall, we know what we're doing. What you doing, babe? I am trying to cut out the bottom of the shower. Oh. Which is a little more complicated than it looks. Why is that? Because of the weird shape of the cutout. Oh. Well, good luck, babe. And it's hot as heck in here. It is hot in the garage. Open the garage door. Probably. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that was fun bringing this in. It was. Too bad it doesn't quite fit. Nope. Now we got to take it uh, back out. It's this down here that's wrong. But this lines up perfect. Perfect. And this lines up good enough where when we make it bigger, it will fit. Yeah. So we're getting there. We are. We gotta get it out of here back into the garage. Well, I think we're gonna do it right here. Oh, okay. We'll just clean up the mess afterwards. That's fine. Yeah. Babe, I'm impressed with you just freehanding these circles. Well, it doesn't have to be exact because there's gonna be a like plate that goes over top of it. Yeah, well that's that's a plus, but still you did good. I'm more impressed that this good is like job. up against the wall. Right? And it can actually be screwed in. It's getting there. And it has a proper gap at the bottom. Like, that means impressive. Yeah, you did good, babe. Thanks. You keep trucking away at that, uh, what, where's the, oh, that's that for the handle, huh? Okay, there it goes more. Cool. And we are finally screwing this into place. Yeah. That's awesome. Stop. Doesn't that make it look so much better? Yeah, it does. A regular piece of, regular piece, regular <laughs> piece of drywall here. Perfect. Looking good. I'm excited. Okay, I need some screws. All right. Honey. It's looking better. We have a corner of the shower. We do. It's looking nice. Yeah. Uh, but our kid needs picked up. Mm -hmm. So let's go get our kid, come okay. back, clean up a little bit. Yep. Maybe do a little bit of work, but uh, kind of get our evening going. Sure. So, made it home from picking up Lincoln. We did. Uh, time for dinner. I'm starving. I'm grilling out. We're going to have some hamburgers. I'm so excited for you to grill out. Uh, of course, we're having salad with it because uh, <laughs> we, we, have so much we love our lettuce. Yeah, the, the amount of lettuce we have. I'm not complaining. I absolutely is, love it. Yeah, amazing how well these are growing. Even the ones that are like falling off to face earth are still growing pretty good. Now, they don't get a lot of sun anymore because they're like in a great hole. But, the great abyss over there. Yeah, they're still doing good. <laughs> Babe. It's time. Time to pick our two cherry tomatoes. I know, they're so, so cute. Pick away. I'll pick one. <gasps> Here we go. There's one, I get the other one. Yeah. Like, we're so corny. <sighs> That's so awesome. I'm so excited Look for our them. tomatoes. They're so cute. They are cute. They're gonna look so nice with the rest of the red tomatoes. Yes. Okay, uh, let me get some lettuce. <laughs> we're making way too much of a deal out of this. I'll get some lettuce and get the hamburgers cooked. Okay. Well guys, it is now the evening and uh, we ate dinner. I got changed, showered, feel so much better now that all the drywall dust is off me. Came down here, I'm like, hey, let's look at the bathroom again. No, it's dark. We can't do that. Uh, we never put the light in, and we're probably not going to put the light in until almost the end. Uh, maybe, maybe a little bit earlier just so we have light so I can work on it in the, you know, after dark. Fail on my part. Uh, so yeah. Uh, but it looks so much better. I mean, you can't tell. I guess you can see the green board in there. It looks so much better with like one and a half walls done. I know, baby steps, but uh, small victories for me. Well guys, I guess the only thing left to do this evening is uh, grab a pina colada and drink. Yeah. And relax and uh, get ready for tomorrow's adventure. Mm -hmm. Whatever that might be. Cause I really have no clue what it's gonna be yet. I work all day. Yeah. You're on your own. I'm on my own. And you're drinking my pina colada. I guess mm -hmm. it's our pina colada. Guys, good. hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, the shower, the bathroom is slowly making its way to a finished state. <laughs> we still got a lot more work to do in that bathroom. Yeah, but you gotta admit it's starting to look like a bathroom again. It is, yeah. Okay. 
uh, rambling on like we typically do. Good night, guys. Good night. Bye.